And then that's um, spot Bitcoin exchange traded fund flows are likely to remain high until the Bitcoin halving later this month, according to on-chain analytics firm Santiman. Uh, the blockchain data firm observed that Bitcoin ETF volume hasn't slowed since the asset hit an all-time high in mid-March, adding that trader activity is still notably higher than the turning point that began in late February after an influx of individual trading began in a post on X on April 8th. And then Santiment went on to predict that it is a likely foregone conclusion that the high ETF activity will continue leading up to the Bitcoin halving in around two weeks. Uh, the Bitcoin halving event, which happens every four years, is predicted to occur on April 20th. There's been $3.19 billion in daily volume between the top seven ETFs, according to Santiment. However, it will be interesting to see whether a drop-off in ETF volume and on-chain volume will occur directly afterward. It added. Lucas Keeley of Yield App recently suggested that the accumulation of Bitcoin via ETFs could reduce the likelihood of large swings after the halving. Uh, spot Bitcoin ETF volumes soared to $111 billion in March, almost tripling the volume for the previous month, which highlights uh, consistent interest in the products. Uh, Bitcoin ETF inflows picked up at the end of last week um, with two days of more than $200 million in net inflow on April 4th and 5th, according to Farside investors. Um, that followed a couple of low days earlier in the week um, with an $85.7 million outflow on April 1st um, in, uh, in what appeared to be a trend reversal from the strong few days in late March. Um, and Grayscale continues to drag the aggregate figures down with consistent outflows every trading day since it converted to a spot ETF in mid-January. Last week, the firm's GBTC fund showed $738 million, bringing the total amount of BTC outflow from the product to 294,313 BTC. Uh, industry executives uh, remain confident. Um, however, um, Ripple CEO uh, Brad Garlinghouse predicted that the total crypto market value will double this year, primarily driven by spot ETFs and the Bitcoin halving. Uh, I'm very optimistic. I think the macro trends the, the big picture things like the ETFs, they're driving for the first time real institutional money. They told CNBC on April 7, 